We had a very memorable football season in the area with some great players and teams. Maple Grove made the Class 6A semifinals while Cooper had its first unbeaten regular season. We've consulted with coaches in the Northwest suburbs and now present the Sports Jam All Area Offense. It all starts up front on our Sports Jam Offense with the O-Line. Maple Grove's tackle number 67, Trent Tater, was the most physical lineman for a strong Crimson offense. The 6'3", 275-pounder was a two-year starter and had a strong career. Armstrong guard number 76, Troy Casperson, a 6'4", 270-pound senior, was a leader for the Falcons. Strong and athletic, Casperson was named Suburban Blue Offensive Lineman of the Year. Cooper's number 76, center Cedric Williams, is the lone non-senior on our line. The 6'2", 260-pound junior helped the versatile Hawks offense do a variety of things while earning his team's Lineman of the Year award. Number 62, Braden Fitzgerald of Benilde St. Margaret's had a strong year on both sides of the ball. We'll use him at guard. The 6'2", 210-pounder is a feisty athletic performer who also excelled at linebacker and on special teams. Number 72 tackles Zach Collins of Totino Grace is an ornery physical presence on both sides of the ball. On offense, Collins was voted Metro North O-Lineman of the Year. He will play in the All-Star game. Our quarterbacks are led by Cooper's number two, Cameron King. The two-year starter helped the Hawks to one of the best seasons in program history, throwing for 1,524 yards and 21 touchdowns. King was Suburban Gold Offensive Player of the Year and has offers from Concordia St. Paul and St. Cloud State. Rex number eight, David Roddy, is a beast at 6'5", 245. A good athlete with a strong arm, Roddy threw for 1,871 yards and 22 touchdowns, earning team MVP in all district honors for the Mustangs. Benilde's number 17, Tommy Anderson, helped the Red Knights to another strong campaign after they won the 4A title in 2016. Anderson threw for 1,078 yards and 19 touchdowns while rushing for three more scores. Anderson was Suburban Red Offensive MVP. Our running backs are led by number 26, Junior Evan Hull of Maple Grove. Strong and shifty, workhorse Hull carried the ball 344 times for 2,174 yards and 19 touchdowns for the 6A semifinal. Brayman comes in motion, they get the Hull! Oh Touchdown, gosh. Maple Grove! Number 20, Ernest Wardslow of Champlain Park was also tough to stop. Wardslow at 5'11", 180, breaks a lot of tackles. He rushed for 1,019 yards and seven touchdowns. Park Center's number four, Emmanuel Tamba, was a big play threat for the Pirates. The speedy Tamba rushed for nearly 1,000 yards and caught passes for another 275, and he had 12 touchdowns total as a junior. Tamba was an all-district selection. Our wide receivers include number 21, Joe Raymond of Maple Grove. One of the heroes of the miracle comeback against St. Michael Albertville with catches like this one-hander. Raymond had 31 Look receptions for 576 yards and five TDs. He also rushed for 289 yards and four touchdowns while also excelling on defense. Number three, Pedro Amusu was a breakaway threat for Cooper. Small and speedy, Amusu caught 34 passes for 668 yards with six touchdowns. He was team offensive MVP for the Hawks who went undefeated in the regular season. Number 10, Charles Wiley of Brooklyn Center is a very athletic wide receiver. Wiley hauled in 41 passes for 754 yards and 11 touchdowns for the improved Centaurs. Wiley was an all-district selection. Exarian Hill of Hopkins is just 5-5 but gave opposing defenses fits. Hill had 39 catches for 583 yards and three touchdowns while earning all-district honors for the Royals. Our tight end is Wyzetta's number two, Billy Revere. The 6'4", 235-pound junior was a physical force who also got involved in the passing game with 16 receptions and one touchdown grab. Our kicker is Armstrong's Matthew Jager. The Suburban Blue Special Teams MVP has a strong and leg and made five field goals. He also averaged 37 yards per punt and will play in the All-Star game. Our special teams ace is Cooper's number seven, Phoenix Sproles. The North Dakota State recruit averaged 28 yards per punt return and was Suburban Gold Special Teams Player of the Year. 
He averaged 40 yards per kick as a punter and had four touchdown receptions as a receiver while excelling at safety on defense. Sproles was an all-district pick. It's a pretty strong group. The Sports Jam All-Area Offense. And these guys also had strong seasons, the honorable mention picks for offense.